Oh, Christmas it's been ten great episodes of Buckers and Myers. Ten great episodes, episodes of your of favorite role playing. Yeah. yeah, it's totally yeah. not yeah. D and D. Yeah, <laughs> that was good. That was perfect. First that was time. Perfect. Fucking fantastic. <laughs> Sam, you didn't look like you liked it. What happened? I don't even remember where. So we I are. just watched the video because that's okay. what I do before we do these. Uh, so you guys uh, got away from the dragon, Venom Fang. Venom oh, Fang right. flew away, and then you right. found a bunch of uh, crates of coke up where Venom Fang had been hanging out. You did the coke, and then you met a another little old wizard because this part of the world is apparently every area has a little old wizard there. Yeah. So you met him and uh, accidentally threw him down the stairs, and Peppermint accidentally threw a rock out his chest, <laughs> and then he tried to squirrel. Head. And, and, and I his saw, head, they hit his chest. I saw in the comments that everybody was a, 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 a little annoyed that uh, you, you let us get off easy with that uh, dragon. Like yeah, people, I, I guess that dragon, people know that dragon, like that's a famous dragon well, from this the is game. A, this is a famous adventure. It's like the go-to prerequisite first uh, adventure for this game. Okay. So, uh, but yeah, I mean, I, I kind of wanted to melt one of you, but I kind of don't want to melt one of you, you know? Well, so, I did, I died. You like almost way. died. Yeah. Almost. Died. All right. So it's it's the morning after your coke party. It's uh, you know, uh, you're sleeping kind of late because everybody did a bunch of cocaine. <laughs> There's I didn't one. sleep. I didn't sleep. I I I just pulled through and watched the sun come up doing lines. Okay. And I, I was doing lines with him. I'm. I'm okay. So peppermint and, and boba. Uh, peppermint and hyphen are awake and so we, we actually uh, had like a we really bonded last night over blow we just like had one of those like talk a mile a minute at each other we're gonna start a band you know yep. soon when this is over we're gonna paint the whole tower like a different color yeah together yeah okay yeah so you're I telling want... me that peppermint spent the night with uh hyphen all night just ripping lines yeah. and nothing happened nothing happened yeah no Did not even roll? trying <laughs> Should we roll for that? <laughs> it doesn't well, seem to work. You don't no, get to roll for that unless one of us decides that we I want know, to try if something happens. I know, but I, I just want something horrible to happen. But I, I was going to roll for something believe. else. So uh, hold on. Let me roll, roll this real quick. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, it's only a nine. Okay. So while Peppermint and, and uh, Hyphen are up, you see Pip wake up and look around and he starts trying to sneak away, but you totally like catch him in the act. Pip? Pe Peppermint and I do. Yes. But Fut and and Bobo are still asleep. They're asleep. Yeah. I, I would I would grab Peppermint and be like, let's let, let's let's see what this kid's doing. I, is he leaving? Let's watch. <laughs> yeah. To, what the fuck? Yeah. Let's not let's not stop him. I just want to see if he's actually escaping. If that's so, what like, if you know, if uh, uh, Wizard Head, whatever his name is, I can't remember your name, Fut Buckerson. Yeah. If he wait, if he wakes up and Pip is gone. Like, what are we gonna say? Did we'll we be like, get out of here? Are you kidding? Well, we gotta find him. You know, whatever. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Who gives a shit? Okay. <laughs> Sounds good. Yeah. All right. Also, so, by the way, if a child wants to, you know, escape bondage, you know, who are we to step in the way? Uh, yeah. His bondagers. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't hear bondagers. anything. Did you hear anything? Yeah, I didn't hear anything. No. No, no one okay. said. Um, so, so we're gonna do a, another check for him to. The, all right, so he got a 17, so he sneaks he sneaks down the stairs, and you just see him creep out the door. The door opens into the daylight, and Pip gets out of there. I'm like, get all the right, fuck I out wake of up. here. He, he fucking bailed. He's gone. All right. All right. Okay. So we didn't see I like him. I like him more. Oh, wait. Oh, God. Okay, fuck. Yeah, you, you, uh, I was rolling like, are you, can you successfully wake up? Yeah, you can. I wake, wake up. up. I look out the window, and I see him trying to get away. <laughs> And then to get away. I, he's, I, he's so off. Pip's 17 of escape, I guess, means nothing if someone else decides they want to well, roll to wake well, I mean, up. I mean, I'm, I'm, I was, hold on, let me, because, you know, people yell out things, and then I got to figure out if I'm going to just let it happen or what we need to do. But I, I think for that, you need to, like, you can't just wake up and be like, I mean, think about it. You just started Coco Night. You can't just wake up and be like, like, right out the window, like, I know exactly what to look for. You know what I mean? So, like, let's, uh, let's roll for your, uh, um, all right. Yeah, you got to make uh, some look. eggs or something, man. Perception, yeah. <laughs> yeah you don't the just wake up and look for your children. That's not how That's the first works. thing I'm going to do when I wake up. I mean, that, that, the last, that kid I stole. The first thing you would do is look for a Waffle House. 
I oh, mean, but... okay, if I don't have to go to work or something, when I wake up, I come out here and start food first, and then I check on my daughter. So, I mean, you know, I mean, so I'm just saying. I'm a very controlling parent. I can see that. Okay. Yeah. So, <laughs> all right. Um, so let's see. Uh, we're going to check your, um, what is that? Perception. All right. All right, we got a 16. So you do uh, notice that uh, somebody's missing. Motherfucker. You don't know who. <laughs> and then I and then I, I go, say I, you, you, see like, the, you see that you see that hyphen and peppermint are awake, but there's you one count again, you count three times. Somebody's there's one other missing. lump on the floor. Who's that one? <laughs> and then you go BIP! <laughs> we we're all running around yeah, in high well school. <laughs> All right, I look out the window and I see him. I take my magic no. missile. No, hold on, hold on, hold on. Jesus Christ, you're gonna shoot at your kid? All right, so you're looking out the window. You only get a two because you just woke up and you've got fucking coke hanging over and you still got shit out your eyes. So you just see like a green field and one dot. You're not really sure what it is. Yeah, I bet that's Pip. <laughs> <laughs> I fire a magic missile like 20 yards ahead of him towards this blurry dot that you yeah, see? Yeah, but one thing we know about magic missiles is they just hit the target. And there's three of them. Okay, I don't do that. You no, know, he kills Pip. Go ahead. Go ahead. No. There's, there goes Pip. All right. All right. No, I go. I run I run after the dot. My last attempt to bring plot back in is that Trevor shoots him from the window. <laughs> I, I, I run after the dot. You're going to try. You're going to. You, so you're going to like run down the stairs. Yeah. Peppermint and I are just, we're continuing to derail. It's just like, wow. All right. And then I yell out the window, hey, what, what? happened, Fudd? What's going on? <laughs> and I yell out the window, run, Pip! He's coming for you! <laughs> I say, my kid's trying to get free. <laughs> my kid's trying to get free. Well, you got oh, a 17 we to get know. down the stairs. So you're getting down the stairs okay, so you can, you're can you getting out the door. Uh, all right, so uh, Fudd's making his way outside, and uh, Fudd, let's see if you can kind of tell where Fip's headed now. You got a four. I don't know. Every time I roll for your like perception, it's not doing very well. I'm so, groggy. Uh, so you're just still kind of like, uh, well, now there's sunlight, right? So you come out of this tower and there's, it's fucking like noon, right? Because it's a coke nap. Uh, so if you wake up at seven, you're just like, oh my God. Yeah. And uh, so you still know that somebody's out there. Yeah. <laughs> uh, meanwhile, inside, what do you uh, coke hangover people want to do? More coke, probably. <laughs> Well, let's bag it up and let's get out of here. Cool. Yeah, let's start. Right. I just start putting we... loose handfuls of coke in my pockets. <laughs> and then I, I'm just I say, dumping hey, it down my do... shirt. Yeah. Then in I say, uh, should we leave Bobo? Yes. Leave him behind too? Dude, these two are going <laughs> to yes. hook up. These two are totally hooking up. <laughs> yeah, he's going to wake up and be like, where the fuck did everybody go? This is great. It'll be hilarious. Right. He'll be yeah. able to follow this white line I'm leaving with every footstep. But that's fine. Yeah. I've literally like packed it so that, that I look like I have a giant beer belly, but it's just Coke in my shirt. <laughs> Let's see how well you pack it. I'm sure you always do grand dexterity. So, well, you got a 10, which is okay. Plus oh, 13. Okay. So you are definitely, there is some falling out just a little bit. Yeah. Um, all right. Well, uh, so meanwhile, Pip is just uh, making it for the trees. So let's see. Let's give him another bout of running. And he got a six. So uh, <laughs> yeah, that's not good. He kind of starts running out of steam, and uh, he's getting closer to the tree line. So is it my turn? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's up? Uh, All right, I, I'm running out? towards the tree line. Hey, you know, there, I saw in a comment on one of the other videos that somebody said, oh, you can do a thing where you go faster, like in a fight, like a dash or something like that. Let's see how far you get. So, all right, oh, you got 19. So you uh, you do oh. catch up to him. Yeah, I grab him. I'm like, okay. what the fuck, dude? I'm sorry, I, I, I'm sorry, Mr. Buckerson. I uh, just wanted to- uh, It's dad. I don't know. I mean, Mr. Buckerson, that's got to hurt. Ooh, Here's the yeah. problem. Today it feels like Mr. Buckerson. Maybe two days ago it felt like that. I don't know. I just, I wanted to get out and maybe uh, do some investigating on my own, you know, kind of see what's going on out here. You guys are kind of doing your thing with the white powder. It felt really good. And I ran along the walls like Jackie Chan or something, but I just, I wanted to get out on my own a little bit. Wow. Too bad. Get the fuck back in the castle. <laughs> 
I'd take um, him back. Well, you can't just say that. Hold on. Let's see. Uh, he's six. How old is he? I don't know. See, you don't I even think, know how old your son is. I think I'm he's like, how six, old are you? I think he's been six and twelve and thirteen. I, let me see. Yeah. <laughs> he's probably got. He's probably got the worst like little kid coke hangover he's ever had you know he's just doesn't know what he's saying he's, he's gonna be a deviant like enough trauma has happened to him in the last oh, week where he's so gonna be like a, a deviant criminal that's yeah, why he a, needs like a strong father figure in his life exactly that's where he's going <laughs> <laughs> look you're talking fucking crazy you're gonna go investigate a child investigator what are you what are you fucking investigating yeah what are you encyclopedia brown say that yeah. to him. that's funny <laughs> what, are you, what are you encyclopedia <laughs> Brown? What are you a yeah, fucking Bobsy twin? You know that I, you know that you I read Hardy boy? Drinks. Are you Frank Hardy or no, are you I Joe like, Hardy? Which one no, are you? No, I'm a modern child. I like Enola Holmes. Um, okay, so he is a. Fuck. That's a. The, anyways. Good. Right. What are you a Ramona the pest? Was she a detective? <laughs> I think sure. so. Yeah. I think she was a pest. <laughs> the pest. It just you know what? It just says he's young. I don't care how old he is. You're, you're too. You don't even know what you're investigating. Come back to the castle. Stop being weird. No, I'm gonna. I'm gonna do this. And he like tries to break away from you and and uh, starts pulling out his sword. Not on you, but like he wants to go into the woods and you know have an adventure. Pulls out his sword like he wants to go into the woods. It has nothing to do with the person physically assaulting him. <laughs> well, I just he pulls the sword out. Not, not on you though. Just like he wants to go into the woods. <laughs> <laughs> I wake up. What? Okay. I Sam's wake up. Wake up. Here comes Bobo, wake it up. You got a seven, so you are pretty confused when you wake up. <laughs> you, you, you don't see anybody else. You're alone in this tower, and you do see kind of on the corners of your vision some like white smudges on the floor. All right, follow the smudges. You and start follow to, like... the smudges. Do you do it with your nose on the ground and your butt in the air like a cartoon character dog? <laughs> 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 Yeah, start you, got, you got an 18 for that so you, you're figuring out you're following the the there's a little white white dusty droplets going out the door mm, yum so Breakfast all right meanwhile uh uh do you guys think any like fans of this are gonna be like man coke seems fun <laughs> yeah i think we're the first people to ever portray coke as fun <laughs> <laughs> If just one young person sees this and does cocaine, we shut our jobs. I'm very anti-cocaine now. Uh, yeah, I, I don't think I would ever do cocaine again. No. Um. All right. So, uh, we're we're gonna get peppermint and uh, uh, hyphen caught up to them. So you guys are making strides across the field. Peppermint rolls a five. Uh. So you know, you're still kind of out of it, and you'd like. As you're running across the field, you trip and fall. <laughs> and uh, hyphen, you're uh, you also trip and fall right with her. You guys both rolled fives for running. So like this coke yeah. is just. <laughs> so. Yeah, this is. Can we do a an action? Can I do a dash? Yeah, well, yeah, you just right? fell because I was just kind of getting you know rolling for movement, but uh, you know, right. I don't know, we're just kind of winging it right now. But uh, yeah, what do you want to do? Um, I find a, a medium-sized rock and I throw it and hit Pip in the head with it for running away. All right. <laughs> it's my homie. Oh, man. You throw a rock at a child's head. Okay. And Fuck's okay with it. He just called her a homie for that. It's a medium-sized rock. It's kind like of a like baseball a baseball size, I'm guessing. Like, yeah, what is medium? Yeah, it like fits in my hand. <laughs> you have all really hurt somebody, but okay. It's a throwing rock. Your hands yeah. are fucking. Your hands are it's gigantic. It's a tisk tisk. Yeah, it's probably a bowling set ball Dude, size you rock. Have like, you, you have like struck your child in the head with from a you, distance. You have like Hulk hands. He's fine. It's like. A Is he skittle. fine? How much damage does it do? Yeah, I'm. I'm working on it right now. I mean, uh, let's see. Plus her strength. Oh, he's fine. He's fine. Walk <laughs> it off, you goddamn sissy. Uh, yeah. What could happen? Well, maybe he's when, learned an important lesson about running away. Yeah. When I was growing up and you did something wrong, all our orc parents like threw a big fucking rock at your head. Yeah, but your orc exactly. skulls are also like rock strength. So he's a little child. <laughs> well, I did it. Um, okay. So uh, the, the rock. <laughs> yeah, I guess you're right. What, what am I even arguing about? You I know. It. I, it's done. The, yeah, rock, the rock hit him. Um, so it's going to do damage to Pip. 
Uh, I imagine this is going to be pretty considerable damage. Timmy, don't softball this damage. Yeah, I'm not going to softball. You hit him for six points. And uh, yeah, so he's like, that like takes down, takes down his hit points about halfway. So um, that sucks. <laughs> So I go. Yeah, he's fine. So, so, but, so, Pip, so, Fut, you are standing next to Pippa. You see him like, oh, oh, and he like kind of starts staggering. He's bleeding off the side of his head. And I go, buddy, that's why you don't run away. And then I go, Peppermint, thank you, but smaller rock next time. <laughs> oh my God. So, uh, two hobgoblins come out of the woods and says, uh, we're looking for the, the Coke performers. That's us. <laughs> what we've got a message for you from the black spider okay come on yeah so uh so one of them comes up in the hands i mean you fought and pip are closest to the tree right they're close i, to I the can't forest. fucking read what I, say, I can't read who can't read me you're a wizard i'm an illiterate wizard and i hand it to hyphen all right <laughs> of course you can't well, hyphen, hy hyphen is idiot. behind you. <laughs> open the thing. Hyphen and Peppermint are still back in the field, so you can hand it to Pip. Pip can read it to you. <laughs> He's a city yeah. boy. That's good. Make, All right. make some use out of Pip. So I Pip, might have caught up at this point, but whatever. Well, I don't know. It doesn't matter. I mean, we're just getting you. We're just kind of getting something going here. So, uh, all right, so Pip uh, opens the letter, and it's just got a black spider stamped on it, or stamped on it, and it, uh, you know, as like the seal on it and it just says uh i i know who you are and what you want and uh i have your former employer gundren and i have the rest of the coke and the means to make more if you come to my castle do we know a gundren yeah you do yeah gundren rock seeker sent us out Thank on, our, you. on our mission <laughs> um okay so can i can i have do we have to roll for me to have walked across grass? No, to, no, no. We can get to that. It's fine. I'm just right. trying to so, know, keep it so, interesting. So I'm like, so you have Gundren. Let me, let me, let me ask you this, Hobgoblin. Is this you have him hostage? Is this like a? I can't tell if you're menacing us or if you're trying to help us. What, what's what's the under? What's the what's the subtext here? We're just deliver the message. We have we have your dwarf. He he. Uh, you. I mean. You mess up Black Spider's drug trade. Hell yeah, we did. And he wants the he wants the coke back. He wants you to come to him, take your dwarf, and uh, work something out. No, okay, so th so this is like uh, this is a veiled this is a threat. Sure, I mean it's the Black Spider, right? And, uh, and there's two of you, right? There's just two of them. Okay, so here's what I propose, everybody. Why don't we cut that one's head off and sew it onto that one's head, so he can go back. Just looking real fucked up and weird, and he can he can you know say he gave us the message, and that'll be that. I love it. I love that. <laughs> that was that was their plan. Oh, you know all this cocaine that you worked so hard to get, give it back to us, or we'll kill a dwarf you met once. Yeah, let's just send two knuckleheads to go talk to the five most lethal people, or four. I guess. <laughs> Come on, what are we doing? Uh, I I leap up and I go for the old eye gouge. All right, on, you're gonna stab him with your thing. Okay. All right. Well, uh, you didn't get that great of a roll. Let me see what you only got an eight. You just missed the first bugbear. Yeah. Yeah. It's a hobgoblin. Hobgoblin. Well, thank you. Jesus Christ. I do a perception check to see what's going on in, in like up ahead. Oh okay. God, you're still in the room. Because <laughs> I'm still far behind. I'm still walking. Jesus, forward. man, you've rolled oh, nothing but distance. seven so far. It's kind of amazing. All right. So, uh, yeah, you got a ten. So you see like some stuff and you. You you go. see off in the distance. Hey, you see what you see. What looks like hyphen go like this and be like ah, because you just missed. I go, hey guys, <laughs> wait up! He's running, but his pants are falling down. He's like pulling his pants up as he runs. <laughs> no, he's sniffing the ground as he's going because he's following your trail. He's like, because he's like Scooby Doo. Yeah. <laughs> the first hobgoblin is going to take a swing at hyphen since that's who was swinging at him. Yeah. Okay. You're clear. You didn't get hit. And now we're at Peppermint. Pissy. Um, I like uh, pick some dirt up out of out of the ground and I throw it in the hobgoblin's eyes. Oh, you got a one. So you throw it and it just like the dirt cloud just poofs right in your face. And now you <laughs> now you have dirt in your eyes. 
Jesus, you got a one. Right. What, what is with you and stuff on your face? Yeah. I'm know. like, get ready. You guys just fucked with the most lethal four motherfuckers in the kingdom. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Like, we're idiots. Yeah, <laughs> just immediately. <laughs> it's so funny that Pip was acting up and Peppermint was like, I'm going to throw a rock at her. But these fucking goblins or hobgoblins show up and she's like, I'm going to throw dirt at these guys. Yeah. <laughs> also, she has, she like very athletically hits the child with a rock. But then when the shit goes down, she's like, oh. <laughs> oh, man. All right. Well, now we got the other hobgoblin. So he just kind of looks at Pepper and like, what the fuck? And swings a sword at you. Uh, oh, God. He got a 20. Like, well, oh, actually just the hobgoblin did? Yes. Yeah. Oh, so no. that hits you. Uh, Wait, who is he hitting? Peppermint? Peppermint. Man. Oh, fuck. I don't have my... Like, Bobo, Bobo, hurry! <laughs> <laughs> Bobo, what the um, fuck are you doing? I don't have my wooden barrel armor on anymore, do I? Uh, no, it's something that broke off because then you fall off the stairs and it broke off. Yeah, yeah you also uh, don't have your lucky doorknob mouth anymore, do you? <laughs> lucky <Yeah>. doorknob mouth. <laughs> Good there goes old doing that mouth. I'm gonna be fucked. Well, you were at you were at your full HP, but shit, man, she, he just fucking hauled ass on you. So uh, you're uh, like already not doing well. You're like down to about nine hit points right now. So oh, shit, she might need right. some help. Okay, so that was second one. Now we're at Fut Buckerson. Um, I put my armor on Pip. Your magic armor spell? My magic armor. Go okay. Put it on Pip. What about me? You got nine. I, got I know. He's got like, what, three? I know, but if another hobgoblin takes a swing at me, I'm done. Doesn't Pip mm. have more than three? Mm. Wait a minute. Hold on. I don't do that. Because okay. I can only use one magic a turn, right? Right. That's your action for your turn. All right. I put both of these fuckers to sleep. Okay. Let's see if you can put them to sleep. All right. One. One. Oh, fuck. Uh, try to get up to, uh, yeah, 22. What does that do? Okay. Dude, okay, I swear, this is rolled a one three times. Dude, you're, I don't want to use your magic tower thing. Just roll yeah, it like Yeah, it's killing us. Oh, sh God, you guys. All right. So, okay, so you got one of them asleep. <clears throat> so the, uh, the one that was, uh, the one that Fett was swinging at just kind of falls over asleep. So, so Pip is going to uh, swing his short sword at uh, the other at the other one, the one that just hit. That can I say? Can I say to Pip? Hey, 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 buddy, yeah. just just run, get away. You got you got hit with a rock. This is what I want to do, Dad. Now he's Mr. dead, All Mr. Right. Muckerson. Oh my God, he got a four. Yeah, these guys have kind of a high uh, armor class. So no, he does not hit the hobgoblin. I'm going to use my javelin. Okay. To go for the one guy that's awake. The one that's awake. Good call. <laughs> All right, I'm going to try the magic tower. Because <clears throat> the last time I rolled for you, you got like a good a good roll on that. So. This one. You got a 20. Oh. Look at that, man. All right. Oh, yeah. yeah. The tower gives and the tower takes away. Fuck yeah. All hail the tower, I guess. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, so you definitely hit that motherfucker. Anyway, so you hit him pretty hard. So this guy's over halfway dead, let's just say that. And that's the one that was standing at Peppermint by Peppermint and just like fucking wounded her heavily. All right, now it's Hyphen's turn. Um, okay, so that, the guy that's standing over Peppermint is like great, is seriously wounded? Yes. All right, so I'm going to just like uh, step behind him and see if I can shove my dirk up his ass. <laughs> All right. Do you say so, anything? Up yours. <laughs> <laughs> up your button around the corner. Yeah, up your button around the corner. Yeah, that's what I say. <laughs> All right, so you sneak past him, okay? And you get that thing right up his asshole. <laughs> and, Good. Uh, you wrecked him. <laughs> <laughs> and you got just enough hit points mm -hmm. to kill him so uh, you know the blade enters his asshole and he's already bleeding to death from his javelin in his chest and so the blade enters his rectum and just you know 
the pain of having metal just you know decimate your o-ring just like shuts his brain and heart down and he falls over so whoa yeah. i take yeah, so... i take the sword out it's covered in shit and i go like i like kind of like do that and i go pip come here come here buddy oh no <laughs> i want you to have him you know uh next time a man i don't care who that man is tries to grab you and take you somewhere you don't want to go <laughs> this is this is for that moment he's like okay it smells terrible you're gonna want to go wash that off in a river or something this is like the first act of the john travolta <laughs> nicholas cage movie face off dude i was just gonna make a face off line okay anyway so because that rolls an 18 on pip so he goes oh thank you hyphen i fucking love face off <laughs> <laughs> there is that thing. if he grabs you you put it in his leg you twist it so the wound doesn't close i remember yeah that I, yeah I say that, that to him i say that <laughs> <laughs> that, that would be uh that would be nick that would be john travolta as nick cage's character i believe says that anyways uh okay so uh so uh fut takes or fut uh pip takes your shit sword and uh puts it in his back pocket and then i say but you know I, now that i think of it i really will need a weapon so let me have your sword <laughs> you want my 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 clean sword yeah because you gave me your, your shit covered sword i'm sorry yeah. you gave well me you don't your... want me to have no weapon i just come on you failed to convince him this time you got a floor he goes i'm sorry uh hyphen you know what i'll just take all that all those lessons you told me remember them with my sword so here's your here's your sword back Fuck I take my sword back. Look at the dick. <laughs> All right. So, uh, I like a little tear goes down my eye and I wipe it away. <laughs> <laughs> Not even, that's good. Okay. So, uh, all right. Um, so, I mean, you guys are here in this town. You've, uh, killed the messengers literally. Uh, Basically, you know, uh, so there's one still asleep. Yeah, we oh, yeah, gotta cut his head off and sew it onto the other one. Yeah, we gotta we gotta well, hack his head off. Cut the we should... dead one's head off. Right? That's what we're doing. Yeah. Oh, I thought you said cut the live one's head off and sew no, it to the other one. Cut the dead one's head off, put it on the live guy, and then leave him. You're sewing this onto the sleeping guy. Uh huh. Yeah, I, th I think yeah. we sew it onto the side of his face, so he's got like he he he's normal, but he's got just like a a dead head attached to his head. It's, it's... Yeah. Yeah, and it and we're. <laughs> We could do the neck hole on the top of the head and go all the way around. So he's got like two like heads, two heads? totem pole kind of. Why stuff. don't we sew it to his dick? So it's like the dick's in the other head's mouth, and we sew them together. So he wakes up and he's got to go back with his head in between his legs. Like, I like that because then when he when he pees, his urine will eventually fill up the head, and it'll just start leaking out of the eyes and ears, and it'll just be a. Yeah. Mouth. I wouldn't go. Out yeah, the yeah cool. but. I was gonna say like sewing it to the side of his face, like to the side of his face was yeah. like while he's still alive and talking to him while we're doing it, I was looking forward to. Oh, well, we well how are we gonna make this decision guys? We got a lot of great <laughs> ideas. I'm fine with whatever. That's okay with or, whatever. Or you know what we could do? We could, we could, instead of just like keep rolling for like sewing and stuff like that, we could just leave this fucker and uh, like go kill that dude that sent him. All right, so Peppermint, how about this? What, you want to just cave this guy's, this sleeping guy's head in, and then we'll move on? Yeah, I'll, I'll sit on him. Sit on him. All right, let's see how much. All right, <laughs> you got a 20 for that. See, the tower's back. The tower's good. <laughs> All right, so so Peppermint put, takes her uh, posterior and just, you know, shoves it onto the guy's. But it's just, my, it's just my right butt cheek. Just your right butt. I mean, because you, you've got serious, like you're I imagine your butt like green, but like the size of like station from Bogus Journey, like when it's the one big guy at the end, and he has that gigantic ass. That's what I'm thinking of. Okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <He's> like, <"Shh>, sure. <laughs> All right. Well, you did enough damage to kill him because you got a critical, you got a fucking 20 for that. So critical face sit damage. So yeah, you just like splush the guy's fucking head just <laughs> into the ground. And, and it um, makes a really funny sound and we all just, start laughing. Yeah, yeah, just it's great. And uh so uh the gotta, goblin hey, the hobgoblins are dead. I go, hey guys, what's going on? <laughs> He's uh I, I just woke up and I you guys were fighting, so you just Pip woke tried up to run and away. I threw a spear. <laughs> <laughs> but nailed him. 
Yeah. Right. No, you got him. I say Pip tried to run away, and because of that, we got attacked. Mm. Yeah. Hold on. Hold on. Hold, hold on, Mr. Buckerson, Dad, whatever I'm going to call you. Look, Bobo, I like you and I like hyphen. And I was trying to run away because I, I just wanted to see what was out there without getting in trouble with all these drugs and stuff. And as soon as I got a little further out into this field, these guys came and they wanted to uh, threaten us. Why? Because of your drugs and stuff. So I'm just trying to get away from that. Maybe try. And yeah, but we wouldn't have been threatened. We wouldn't, they wouldn't have been able to threaten us if we weren't all the way out here by the woods because you were they trying were to. They were going to walk to the castle. The castle's like right there. You don't know that. The letter was for you. <laughs> so, uh, uh, Pip, you, do you, you think, think they were sent to the middle of the field or do you think they were sent to the Coke castle where the guys are with the Coke? Do you want to go to sleep? Man, enough, they, enough there's talk. a lot of fucking talk back with this kid. I pick up a medium-sized rock. <laughs> so Peppermint's got the medium-sized <laughs> rock. You're down to like three hit points, kid. <laughs> and I know you try to hurt my feelings being like, I like Bobo. I like Hyphen. I don't need to be liked. I'm your dad. It's just, okay? you know, I think, and I mean, you know, as a dungeon master, I agree with that parenting stance. I'm not here. Role playing the kid. I have to say, you know, he's a, uh, He's like that, you know. I, 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 you, you took me from my home. My mom uh, is God uh, knows it where. Was a shit home. You don't Thank know you. that. You just. I, I actually got to agree with, home. but your your home sucked ass. You guys yeah. just decided that during your your weird comedy show where all the people were floating Look, around being killed. We saw what town you're from, dude. It's yeah. a dump. Okay. You, What's your you grew up like? in filth. You I would said? have no frame of reference. You would not know. It's like why they turn up the heat when they put lobsters in, like, you know, or, or what's the animal they do that to? They cook yeah, something. Yeah, crabs and lobsters, yeah. Something like that. You have no idea that your situation sucks because everything around you sucks, you know? Like, we come in from a different town. We're like- From the coast. We're from the coast. Yeah. Where we've like, you know, we've seen some shit and we're like, oh, this kid's life fucking sucks. Let's help him out. And then this is what you do. You get peppermints. Peppermints got like nine points left because she got hit by a guy because of you. Like, I, I think that, why, why don't we just nip this in the butt? Pip, apologize to Peppermint, and we can all move on. Peppermint, I'm sorry that because of my actions. Uh, just, as, I'm uh, sorry. Just, I'm as sorry. As a raucous youth, Here the, comes some sarcasm. Uh, messengers found oh, you no. five minutes earlier than they would have. Peppermint, yeah, there it small, is, right there. Sarcasm. Get a, get a small rock. But you got to discipline this kid. I put him to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna put him to sleep. All right, let's see how we do it. Uh, I think I roll eight D for that. This is your second spell of the day, by the way. Parenting's important. <laughs> All right, well, you put him to sleep. So you, uh, Pip falls asleep. All right, now I what are we gonna do? A, that was a good move. Uh, I go but... fuck around and find out. Pip. <laughs> <laughs> so you put him to sleep, which is to some people a reward. Like now what? I sling yeah, him over my through. shoulder. Yeah, throw them All right, on the now back. what are we doing? We're going to go kill this, this whatever it is? Is it a dragon? Okay, is it a so spider? The, uh, the note says, uh, the, it, it, it's it's Cragmaw Castle. It says, I'm waiting in Cragmaw Castle. So uh, that's uh, just down the road from Thunder Tree. And uh, uh, All right, well, hold on. I, I want to take an action and, and heal up if I can. Yeah, you got to, yeah, you, you're only missing one hit point now. So Sweet. And Pip is back to... Uh, Pip has a little over half left. Is there anything uh, on these hobgoblins? They have a, a, a map leading them back to the to Cragmaw Castle. That's uh, where um, the Black Spider is currently headquartered. Nice. Okay. I grabbed the map. You know, if we kill this spider, it seems like a lot of our problems are over. Because I think all these dudes are coming from him, right? Now, I'll be honest, I have not been paying attention to what's been happening to us. <laughs> but I feel like all these guys are coming from this spider, right? Is that I right? I think so. Here's what I know. Our lives were fucking great about 10 days ago. You know, <laughs> everything was fine. And then trouble just started following us around. Like everywhere we go, everyone's like getting our face, trying to like start shit. And... Mm -hmm we're like if we this guy keeps coming up if we just fucking take this dude out we're on easy street but 
yeah what I'm say it's, is this is this is the first sketch group i've been in maybe that's just what it's like to be in a sketch group it's people are always trying to start shit with you this like, i've been in a lot yeah. of sketch groups i've been in a ton and this is what always happens you always get you know there's a bloodbath every other day and you're getting threats from far off you know kingpins this is par for the course so, so we could right, quit well, the sketch troop I, but like I like doing sketches. It's no, fun. no, 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 no. We're yeah. hilarious. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. When you're as good. funny as, as, as Buckerson and Myers, you don't you don't quit for some dickhead spider. We owe it to the people. It yeah. would be unfair yeah. to everyone else. Yeah. We've you know, and it's weird at because hundred percent of the shows that we've done. Think about That's that. True. That's true. Yeah. It's it, it's weird because like uh the last 10 days to me have been just absolutely fucking insane because before that the rest of my life i i've never even been in a fight before really are you yeah kidding? yeah what so this, these last 10 days have been bananas but when wow. you killed when crazy. you killed greg myers you fucked him up well yeah like i'm talking about before that that's where it all that started. was your first fight greg, greg myers. myers yeah holy shit dude you're a fucking natural yeah. well i mean i was trying to impress you and, me? Uh, yeah. You don't even know me. You were fucking him up before I, I even opened the door. Well, you're a wizard. You're a little intimidating. Oh, because you saw me at the bar. That's right. We I forgot we talked. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> right. What's surprising um, to me is that you seemed to your your life before us was boring, was like very mundane. You're crazy I, as shit. I can't imagine yeah. you having a normal life. Dude, what do you I, do for I a had living? a I had a garden. Like, what? like my life was nothing. Yeah. Dude, I grew vegetables. That's it. You tell me you that learn the, something new every day. That the woman yeah. who grabbed a barrel and, and threw it on his armor on a whim. Yeah. <laughs> had you ever, here's a question. Had you uh, committed sexual assaults prior to meeting us? Was that part of your past? The, the well, I don't know about that. I can't answer that yes, question. Because that's, that's a yes. yes. That's right. a you, yes. You did rape people before you came across No, that. I mean, I don't know. Oh, we God. should move on. Okay. <laughs> well, <laughs> we, we exhausted that avenue. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So uh, as you're walking through the woods towards the castle, a giant spider tries to sneak up on you, but only rolls a fucking three. And so like a spider falls out of the trees right behind you guys and you hear it. Oh, it's that fucking God spider that we're it. looking for. No, no. The, okay. The, I'm not going to say anything. This is a giant spider. Remember this how you is... walked up on the tower? There's dead giant spiders. Well, here's another Remember, one. I think the, the black spider is a name. I don't think it's a literal spider. I think it's a literal spider. I think it's a literal spider. I think it's well, like, in like this a... fucking crazy world, you think a guy named black spider isn't going to be a big black spider? I mean, oh, wait, wasn't the dragon called like Venom Fang? Venom Fang. His name was yeah. Venom Fang. He had like yeah, I thought he was gonna be a spider too. So I, I don't know. Yeah, me too. <laughs> yeah, you just think everything's <laughs> gonna be a spider. That's your problem. Well, if that is the black, it's not, I'm, I'm taking it. It's not the black spider. No, this is a a a giant spider. Okay. Does this spider up. speak? Is this a magic spider? Or is it just a dumb? This spider? is not a magic spider. It's a big ass fucking spider. I wanted to I give you guys it. something to, you know, whenever he, the conversation was really funny, but sometimes I like to interrupt with the monster. So there you go. I step on it. No. He's a giant. Um, how are you going to step on it? You're going to stand on it? Yeah. Well, how big is a giant um, spider? A giant spider. If I saw a spider this big, that's a giant spider. I think it's giant like a giant spider. Uh, I, th I think it it's like horse us... size. It's like yeah, the size I mean, of a basically uh, or, or like a, a, a yes, but it's like a horse size. It actually says it spiders earlier. Only... Okay, it's a horse yeah, size. So I'm 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 gonna I want to jump on it and uh, take off my belt and try and tame it so that I can ride on it. <laughs> yeah, like honey, I shrunk the kids. <laughs> like Auntie, I'm gonna call it Auntie. Make your hair fuck <laughs> its hair like Avatar. It, now here's the thing though, because there is an animal handling stat and we never use it. So here we go. Here's animal handling. <laughs> All right. Well, first, first pe pissy uh, Pepper has to jump on it though. So let's give her a decent jump. Oh, you got a ten. You get on it. You, you're you're struggling. And let's give a an animal. Oh, you got a very good animal handling. <laughs> Sweet. You got to let's see, 14, 15, 16. So yeah. Yeah, it's 16. So you you barely get on the top of the spider and you have your hands around its uh, 
upper what there's the thorax <laughs> what's the head part called the head Anyways. it's always the head that's okay, universal the head. where the head meets the thorax okay so you got your, your arms around the head and so you have a you have a good hold on it so uh Sweet. i think we'll move just to the next person here okay uh we can just keep walking the spider's tamed <laughs> Um, I, I, don't I now know ride to, on like, a spider. I don't know if I have rules in front of me on how to tame an animal, <laughs> but uh, well, I was thinking like I would have my belt and I could choke it every time it tried to act out, and and I would choke it, and so it would, like basically just submit. You say who's okay. a bad spider? Huh? <laughs> who's a bad spider? Every time you just choke <laughs> it and go, who's a bad spider? Okay, there's room for one more. You know, if you want to ride this with me. I'll hop on there. Yeah, bro. yeah. and All I right. go to Bobo. I'm like, they're totally fucking. <laughs> they're totally fucking. Um, um, roll, and then I, I say I hyphen. You're gonna have to put your arms around my. Well, here's the deal. My, I just rolled waist. for hyphen and jump on there, and he got a two. So hyphen slips. But oh. uh, you want to try and catch him? Maybe you can make a saving throw. Peppermint. Uh, sure. Let's see if you can yeah. catch him. All right. So you you catch him with one arm. You you got a. Uh, what did you get? You got like a 14 on that. So you made I go to Bobo. Him. I'm like, their kid is just going to be like regular. <laughs> <laughs> this is this episode has made me decide that I do want them to get together, though. So they're already together. I don't buy this. They didn't hook up or in the Coke thing. Because uh, we just like, guys, all night. nothing happened. Yeah, up nothing to this, happened. Up to this God. point, every time like hyphen, like she touches hyphen, he's like, ugh, 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 like that, and like now he's like, I'll ride with you, like you know, <laughs> something changed last night. You know, you're on it, and you have your arms around it, but uh, it it's uh, it rolled a nine for strength versus your uh, seven, so, so it's, it's like not kind tamed, of, huh? It's not tamed. It's not quite tamed. It's still thrashing mm. around. Got it. Um, but so now we're going to go to uh, Bobo. I kind of like step back a little bit and watch this happen. <laughs> That's your turn. Great move. Awesome move. <laughs> I mean, he tried to think, I, I, I buddy. watch what's happening. <laughs> I'm not going to, I'm not going to try and kill it. He's trying to tame it. You could, you could help maybe trying to like calm it down. I don't know. This is the, the, there isn't a lot in the beginner stuff about taming spiders. I go, whoa, baby, whoa, <laughs> whoa, <laughs> easy there. Oh but if you God. were ever if you are ever considering like a surprise sneak attack lethal move on on Bobo, may I suggest now? <laughs> Jesus Christ! All right, all right. So uh, yeah, Sam, you uh. You start woeing it down like uh, I'm imagining the Whoa, crocodile on D thing, eh, eh. <laughs> where he puts the ox to sleep. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, so yeah, so you start kind of uh, you know wooing. You're wooing the spider, yeah, and so yeah, the spider yeah. does start to calm down a little bit. All right, uh, fu- how do you want to interact with the situation? I punch it like right in its <laughs> compound eye, and I'm just like, stop. Yeah. Like a warning signal. Okay. Yeah. Quit uh, it. He got a natural 20 on that. This tower, this tower is great. I know we had questions. We had doubts about the tower, but I mean, it's got a lot of 20s out of this thing. A lot of 20s, yeah. A lot of 20s. All right. So you did a uh, three, uh, four damage to it. So yeah, just a little bit. You know, it doesn't do a whole lot of damage to it, but you punch it in the eye of the spider, like, yeah. So Knock the it spider off. has calmed down at this point. Now, how how is everybody's saddle making stats? <laughs> I don't know about that. Darren I, I can hour. ride. I, I can ride it bareback. I'm good. Okay, so so peppermint. And so let's set the scene. Peppermint and hyphen are. And then I go. Oh, now somebody's cool with riding bareback. Oh, kidding, kidding. I'm joking. I'm joking. I look at Bobo and I'm like, <laughs> No, I hear it. I hear it. And I just I just roll my eyes. I'm like <laughs> <laughs> fucking weird now. <laughs> yeah, I like them better when they weren't a couple. Oh my god, this is such a good dynamic. All right. Um I'm gonna see if uh feel like a fifth wheel. <laughs> uh I just rolled and Pip is still asleep. So none of this has woken him up. 
I got five more magic spells. He's going to be asleep for a while. <laughs> Take it easy, dude. We're about to go fight a big black spider. All right. I'll sleep before it. <laughs> I'll sleep before. All right. Spell number three. Put yourself. myself to sleep. <laughs> That'll be my last one. Now you go. To See ya. <laughs> when I wake up, I'll have more of these bitches. <laughs> it's, a, it's a perpetual motion machine. In the middle, it's wishing for more wishes. Yeah. And the or the orcs just have axes going down. I'm like, he doesn't know how magic works. I know. <laughs> All right. So you guys are riding a spider. And so uh looming over the hill, you see a, a big uh dilapidated castle. God. Oh, it's dilapidated. Uh, I threw that in there. I don't think they said oh. it's dilapidated, but I'm about to read it. I bet it does. I mean, because if it says dilapidated for this thing, this is the worst written thing ever. Okay, the stronghold consists of seven overlapping towers. However, its upper levels have long since collapsed to heaps of crumbling masonry. Only the ground floor is still sound enough to be habitable. No dilapidated. So that's, okay, that's some good. evolution on the part of the writer. That's good. They Every out... fucking building in town in this world except Phandalin is destroyed. But Gary they, Sinise this... or whatever the guy who made this, he like looked up a thesaurus. That's good. Gary, like, Gary Gygax. Yeah. Gary Gygax. Gygax. Yeah. Yeah. Gary Gary Sinise. For an editor. Yeah. You ain't got no bugbear, Lieutenant Dan. Um, sorry, that was stupid. Uh, all right. So uh, you're coming up on the hill. You see this big crumbling. Ooh, let's use this word. Yeah, you see crumbling parapets. Of the uh, of this castle, and uh, so you kind of come up on the hill on the side of it. Your uh, that's uh, next to the uh, you see like a, a small dirt road going up to a small gate, and then over you're you're kind of on the uh, southern side of it, and then over on the western side, you know you see like a road, a bigger road leading to probably a bigger gate. But uh, you guys are coming up on like a smaller road leading into the side of the castle. I go, guys, is this the southern side? I look for the sun. I'm like, is, is this the southern or is this, uh, do we know what side we're on of this thing? <laughs> you look for the sun. Uh, we'll just assume that Pip taught you directions. Uh, there an overgrown path leads to a passage that climbs up into the wall and there's a big, there's a big iron door there and arrow slits above the door. <laughs> arrow slits. Everybody know what arrow slits are? Yeah. No. Uh, there's slits they have put in a castle so that the bows, they, they open up like yeah. this. So you see the narrow side so they can pray. I didn't I know did, if you I did, didn't know or not. I don't know. Some people don't know about I was saying I was saying that as my character. Like my character I'm sorry, man. Sometimes I sorry. just forget what we're, what's happening. All right. Hey, oh, guys, I think those are arrow slits. <laughs> and I say, what are arrow slits? So it's like, you know, like when they make a, a little... Bitching band? <laughs> Love arrow slits. I don't want to miss a thing. <laughs> yeah. If I could, I don't know the lyrics to it. If I could hold you there just to see you dying. Right, enough, enough. Do, 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 copyright. Do, 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 copyright. Do, do, do. Oh, yeah. You only no, he, none of the words right. And I don't think anyone could accuse him of hitting that melody. So we're, we're safe. <laughs> There's an asteroid oh, coming. Jesus Christ. And okay. I don't want to get hit. Okay, so uh, you're, you're by this castle. You're near uh, the side door. What do you guys want to do? Should we, should we... Wait, this is where the spider is? The, you followed the directions that were, uh, that were written on a note in the uh, Hobgoblin's uh, let's just Let's knock. Let's see if we can... Uh... Do we want to knock, or do we want to like, maybe pick the lock and sneak around? Can I look, and I, I see a big web. A big web on the side of the castle. And it says, very good pig. And I'm like, a fucking spider lives here. <laughs> Was it that'll do pig or very good? That'll, I don't know. I don't know. No, no. Uh, you're no, thinking Charlotte's Web. Babe. Charlotte's yeah. Web was, uh, yeah. It wasn't a very this spider web says, that'll do pig. <laughs> that'll do pig. I'm like, that's a babe in the pig in the city reference. Spiders love pigs and love yeah. writing about them. This is where the spider lives. I think that was a first babe, but yeah. Also, you don't think they say that'll do pig in the sequel? Also, Trevor doesn't get to decide if there's a spider web on the wall. <laughs> right, that's why I was laughing. I know. Um, no, I, don't... I wonder. I wonder, guys, if this spider is a baby of the the big spider. 
I, Maybe again, we could use that to our advantage. I think it might just be a dude. I look and I see a man arranging another spider web. And I say, oh. and that one says, uh, um, I'm a guy. Pig related. You know. I'm a guy. <laughs> My name is Black Spider and I'm just it's a guy. It says oink oink. Yeah, it says oink oink in that one. I'm like, I don't know if a spider did that, dude. <laughs> Oh my god. What was Piglet's catchphrase? Did he have a catchphrase? Piglet? Uh, did he say oh bother or is that poop? Oh bother. <laughs> no, he said stop oh, trying poop. to kiss me. <laughs> that was What? Am I wrong? I thought Piglet's catchphrase was stop trying to kiss stop me. Stop trying to kiss me, Pooh. <laughs> Pooh, I'm a married man. Oh my god. Stop <laughs> trying to kiss me. Pooh, I love my wife. <laughs> Uh, oh, I, 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 is the door locked you can go up and check i like sam's idea of picking the lock I, i'm assuming i would probably be the one to do that since i am a, a rogue yeah so let's sam, see how sneaky we can be sam gets a 19 for checking the shit out though he, for perception so he looks around the area he sees that yes indeed the door is locked and you notice uh only the keenest eye could have seen that sam good job <laughs> Uh, uh, yeah it's locked i would have seen it open but good job good job <laughs> okay and you also notice that there's no guard standing in front of the door but however there are all those, are those arrow slits you don't know what's behind there Ooh, guys arrow slits might have people shooting arrows at us Whoa, sam your brain is truly a wonder yeah <laughs> But like, if we're like right up next up to the here? castle, can they like really shoot arrows at us? So, I mean, do they have to like aim no. way yeah, down? So would... if we just get right up on the door and the wall, we should be good. Right, without being noticed. Yeah. So, are we all gonna roll sneak rolls? Because I can see this going well. No, no. no. Why don't we find a? I'll... Why why don't we find and skin a cow, and then we'll all get under it, and then we can approach the door like we're just a, a casual like the Trojan cow. cow. And then I'll stick my arm out the mouth, pick the lock, and we'll just move our way inside. I fucking love it. And the guards will be watching Pretty and see good. what they think is the cow tongue unlocking the door. And they'll be like, oh yeah, stuff around here unlocks stuff with their tongues all the time. Yeah. Well, they'll be like, what a what a, a smart cow. Right. Yeah. We'll bring they'll it in try and, and yeah. sell it at market. I mean, you guys are near something cow size. Look, or here's the other thing. Could... This guy invited us here. We could just knock on the door and, and see. Oh, them. yeah. Let's just do that so we yeah. don't have to do like a bunch of I'm not of trying words. to skin a cow and then who's yeah. going to be the front? Who's going to be the back? It's a whole thing. Shotgun. <laughs> Is that the front? Let's just go knock on the door. Yeah. Okay, so you're just going to walk on up to the door. Yeah. Then you're going to knock on it. Yeah. Okay. Hey, spider. We got your letter. Then, We're fucking here. Okay. When you did that, like my spider, when you said, hey, spider, my spider like turned and looked at you. But, Not you. Uh, <laughs> so the door opens and there's uh, one huge fat then, go goblin and he's got seven goblins behind him. Uh, are these, is this all going to be goblins in here? Is that what we're dealing with? I fucking hate these guys. It is a giant spider. Hey, is the big spider living here? What a spider? What? Do you seek the black spider? I yes. hold out the invitation. Yes. Oh, you have the notes. Yes. Uh, we're supposed to. We're supposed to uh, knock you out and take you to him, like uh, tie you up. Well, you're not. That's not going to happen. So just take us to him. Yeah. <laughs> or bring him out here. Let me save you a whole lot of fucking pain. Like we are a fucking hurricane of just death and mm. we're gonna go see your boss like you could watch and then when whatever happens you could just go off and do whatever or you could get killed trying to take us to him which we're gonna walk to him anyway so there's no like you're not even being derelict of duty like we're going to him <laughs> I, I feel like i feel like this talk never gets us anywhere good it, have, it always ends up in can, can we just like I is there something <laughs> It's some, is there something that you want, big fat goblin, like a, a bag of coke or something, and you'll just shut up and let us go to your boss? Is that is that possible? 
And you so, might not. Be- uh, okay, the the guy, go- the, the big fat goblin says, "My name is Yeg. I am the chief cook for our tribe here, which is the Kragma tribe." Don't. We're talking we to led- a fucking cook. Are you yeah. kidding me, dude? <laughs> can well, I speak to your manager? The- you knocked on the side door. Well, who the fuck can tell that with your dumb castle? Like, how uh, are we supposed to know? I Didn't, knew it was uh, north. I knew we were on the north side. We just, <laughs> we're just gonna, buddy. We're just we're gonna go through the kitchen. We're gonna go find the the spider dude. Cool. Why does he have the cook trying to knock us out? Yeah. Well, there's yeah. a bunch what of the goblins fuck? with them. What kind what of Mickey Mouse this? orc operation is this? With the this cook is gonna be easy. A to thug. Call. He's. You got your cook answering the door and trying to like knock out guests. <laughs> You guys might not get this from, you might not have clocked this as this, but because you don't seem really scared, but uh, we're a sketch troupe. <laughs> that makes you a little bit more scared. Okay, so, all right. Uh, Yang, Yang says, okay, I'll find, t- take him. I, I have to keep cooking. You boys take him, take him into the, into the main quarters. So uh, the seven goblins, uh, they are all armed and they say, we will, We'll, we'll take you in to see her right now. How many goblins? There's seven. Seven. Right now. So uh, you're just going to go with them? What do you guys want to do? Yeah, we're, let's go with yeah. them, right, guys? Yeah. So, all right. They're, yeah. they're marked. I, uh, if, I, if I ever have to talk to a cook again. So they, uh, they, they take you down the hallway. Well, you go through this hallway, and then there's like a circular room. That room is kind of ruined, and there's rubble everywhere. Then you take a left through a guard barracks, and there's some more hobgoblin standing point in there. And then as you walk through the barracks, you're kind of giving a tour of the castle at this point. There's a there's a door that you pass by and you hear some familiar growling and roaring come coming through that door and you pass that door. Familiar That's how? Familiar. That's familiar. Uh, it's, it's an owl I heard bear. growling. There was an owl bear in there. Oh, there's uh, an owl bear in there, all right. So. I go, guys, do you think this is the north hallway? <laughs> <laughs> He just doesn't know where. He, okay, okay. So anyway, so you okay? So you pass these doors, you go through this room, and so you come uh, to. And this is just so we know, this is in the northeast of the castle. Uh, there's a, it, it's a big uh, kind of half circle room. You go through a big uh, wooden door, and uh, there's a huge bugbear with a beard sitting on a throne, and right next to him is a giant wolf. And He's a, a bugbear. There's a bug. This is a bugbear, which you fought them before. That one guy was a bugbear. Uh, I'm dirty. assuming this is Black Spider. Hold on, no. I'm not done. The bug. There's a bugbear there, a wolf, and then a very sexy lady, who is a Ooh. drow. A drow is a, a dark elf, and dark elves have like literally like dark silvery black kind of skin and white hair and eyebrows and stuff. And very cool. uh, I'm into that. She's sitting there with them, and I am. Um, I'm into this drow. I'm like, oh, no, no, no. I'm trying to get Pip a mom. I go dibs, dibs on. The, no, you can't dib. Yeah, you can't do it. No, honestly, I dibs like a bunch of times ago because exactly. I was like, so there you go. By your own logic, you've dibs a bunch of times. This is my dibs. I've never dibs. I don't I'm acknowledge the dibs. dibs. I don't acknowledge the you dibs. You dibs a child, the dude. You dibs all these things. You don't just get to like dibs everything. I don't acknowledge this dibs though. It doesn't I matter. lean in and I it's say, gonna be, it's I, gonna be a, a, she looks a like a whore, guys. She looks like a whore. <laughs> yeah, you're fucking jolly green fucking- because I wrote on a Excuse spider me? a night of cocaine with someone doesn't mean we're married, dude. I'm, come on, nothing happened. Peppermint. Okay, what? so, uh, and also in the corner- you hear this a, shit? A, uh, there's a- uh, some some form in the corner tied up and uh, unconscious. Well, that's obviously our Gungeon Rock Seeker. Right. So there you go. Dude, guys, know what I'm gonna do? As soon as we, as soon as we walk in, let's just fucking kill the uh, mm-hmm. dwarf. That way, he's got nothing on us. Like his whole thing is like, oh, I've got their dwarf that they met once. Let's like you know, uh, and then we just walk in and shank him. Then we're like, yeah, now what? You know, we could, or we could, we could leverage him. So we could be like, like, I tell you what, give us the Coke and you can keep our dwarf. Let them think we get, <laughs> but why would he send the note? If he already has the dwarf, if he would take that, he, they think we really like the dwarf. I don't know. <laughs> uh, you're right. That, that didn't or, work. or we, we could go in and kill that dirty whore dark elf. Yeah. That, hey, that won't be happening. That, that is, be. that is Pip's new mom. <laughs> 
That's my Speaking girlfriend. Of, uh, Pip starts shaking a- awake on Futt's arm. And so you like, think Where? you're going to be able to satisfy a woman like that? Look at you. You're like three feet tall. Like, Buddy, you have no idea. You have no I, idea. Sorry, what I'm I have a pretty good Futt. idea. Like, it's it, no, like, it doesn't work like that. And a yeah, lot of people think that. And that's no. prejudice. And that's very hurtful. Oh, well, I guess I'm prejudiced. Okay. Do I have to whip this bad boy out right now? Because I'll, I'll yeah. fucking whip it out. Let's see it. Let's see this magnificent. I, I would, I would, but I don't want this to be my has. first impression with her. That I'm just a guy who pulls his dick let's out. See your massive let's, hog. You know what? Let's, I'm gonna stab Timmy, you if you keep let's fucking. Let's let Timmy roll for how big your fucking hog is. <laughs> he doesn't need to roll for that. That's part of my body. Okay, <laughs> that's independent of his fucking roll. It's in the stats. You know, it's you know what guys stats. with big hogs do? They don't like talk about whipping it out. They just fucking do it. I would do it if I wasn't in front of the schmark smelf over there. Yeah. And I want her to like me. And I don't it's, want getting her to it's getting asshole. smaller. It's getting well, smaller. It's like okay. yes. what kind of a this is a hate crime. What you're doing? This is this is bigoted shit, dude. Okay, sure. and, and whatever. Is, Who cares? I don't give Pip a Pip is waking up. By the way, Pip is up, and Pip's like, "What? What's going on here? Why do you make him asleep again, Mr. Buckerson? And what's his <laughs> play? Uh, what do you What do you guys talk about hogs for? Sleep, sleep. What? Sleep. You're going to put him to sleep again? Yep. Jesus Christ. All right. All right. Oh, fuck. And then I say, I haven't I haven't seen hyphen hog or anything like that, but I bet it's probably a decent size. Thank you, Peppermint. It happens to be. <laughs> Once you're done with this, I want to do a perception check where I look at both uh, hyphen and futz crotches. Okay. Try and, like, compare bulges. Sure. You get down on your knees and, like, put your face really close. Guys, we're like next to a boss, and we're like, having. Can we this- can we get it together for ten seconds so we can talk to these people? Uh, Sam, have you rolled a? Uh, let's see here. I think he. Uh, hold on. Perception. Okay, you got it. You got a nine. So you just kind of see. You, you notice that they both have outlines of bulges. You sense that Hyphens maybe has a little bit more shadow on the bulge than Ooh. than Futz does. Wow, I have a bigger Ooh. dick than you do, and I'm a third your height. Pull it out, dude. <laughs> You pull yours let's, out. Let's see it. Yeah, I'm not going to pull my dick out in front of a little kid, okay? I'll fucking do it. Yeah, I know you would because you're a sick person. <laughs> these are okay. these are real small yeah. dick guy arguments. <laughs> you're a sick person. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Grohl says... As soon as we're out of here, I'm going to pull my fucking dick out and I'll, I'll show oh, you. Sure. I'm, sure, I'm sure I'll ever see your dick. <laughs> All right, so Grohl says, bring them in. So the seven goblins bring you guys into the room. Oh, I thought we were having this conversation in the room. Well, I mean, you're like in the back sort of. In oh, the, okay. I mean, they're, it, if it, so as we're walking up, yeah, so we're having that Grohl, conversation. Grohl and the lady are just both staring at you guys like, okay. Hi. How, hey, how are you? Nice to be nice <laughs> by the way. You look incredible. It's, it's, what, what was your name? You rolled a 19. Uh, thank you. My name is Vyrath. Vyra, that is a, oh my God, that is a beautiful name. And wow. I'm a drow of the Forgotten Realms. You certainly are. And I didn't catch your names, gentlemen. This is a wolf. Right. I guess wolves my, don't have names around here. Okay. <laughs> and my name is Carl. I didn't catch your names. This is a wolf. <laughs> Fucking weird. Wolf named Starl. He has a wolf named Starl. This is my wolf, Starl, and I am Grohl. All of a sudden, it's speak and say. <laughs> so, uh, virus says, uh, her name's virus, virus, yeah, but yeah, I mean, it's yeah, you can have her, dude. <laughs> yeah, right, <laughs> I'll tell you, fine, cool. Okay, virus says, uh, are you Buckers? I presume this is Buckerson and Myers, you got the right. flesh. one and only, right? The uh, the same Buckerson Myers that performed in Fandolin, uh sent away the ghost stripper and keeps picking up uh, the black spider's cocaine across the countryside. We already said You've heard of us, yes. Killed it. We nailed it. Yep. My master has sent me to find out what you know and dispose of you. We're going to kill you and all your friends. (laughs) (laughs) Wait, but... Is this the main spider guy? Is this the black spider guy? Like, is you know, who, is who the black spider guy? Are you asking if girl is the black spider? Yes. Is this guy the black spider? No, 
oh, she, th- this fucking guy, he's not the black spider. And girl just looks at her like, what are you doing? And uh, she's basically, she, it's okay. So uh, Virus says like, I'm, I'm here on two points of business. I'm supposed to stop Buckerson and Myers from interfering with our cocaine line. And I'm supposed to buy a map from this fucking idiot. No, he's not the black spider. Also, just one clue, the black spider has less than eight legs. <laughs> Like one of them got blown off. Well, wait oh, a minute. God. Don't spiders have six God. legs? Spiders have six not. legs. We're pretty sure spiders have six legs, what? lady. Which school do wizards go to? Is that a I'm book? illiterate, you fuck. <laughs> I can I can pay you off and give you back your dwarf friend if you agree to leave the black spider's cocaine business alone. I brought lots of money with me. Some's for the map, some's for you guys. We don't even is like the him, black dude. Spider, is the black spider here? Here? Yes, in this castle. He's on, he, he's, he's waiting for me somewhere else for me to bring him the map. Oh, uh, we gotta kill this map, bitch. You've heard it, you know of the map, you know of the cave that people have been searching for, right? It's full of cocaine and full of a, uh, the spell forge, which will enable you to make that. You guys had the, the dragon's cocaine, right? <clears throat> you Wait know, a minute. You can make more dragon coke. What is that cave that everyone's talking about all the time? It's what it's. <laughs> Let's see. Well, I know that Sildar knew about it. You killed him. That uh, undead mage guy knew about it. You killed him. Why are you so dragon- passive aggressive? <laughs> <laughs> can I huddle up with the guys for a second? Hey guys, hey, 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 it's called, are you it's called her wave. Right it's now? called wave. No, I'm the- talking to Timmy. <laughs> Oh, yeah, this is like, okay. Can I, can I huddle up with the guys real quick? Hold on, yeah, let her finish. Uh, yeah, yeah. Just, she's All saying right. it's called Wave Echo Cave. There's a lot of people in this area who knew about it, but they've mostly been murdered <laughs> lately. Uh-huh. All right, huddle up. Guys, we have we have all the info we need. Wait, w- w- Wavy Cool Cave or something. Um, you don't even know the name of the fucking cave or it's where w- it is. Wavy Cool Cave. Wavy Cool Cave? That's what they said. That's what she said. Hey, Virus, did you say Wavy Cool Cave real quick? No. What did you say? Wave? Wave Echo Wave. Cave. Wave, Wave echo. echo Cave. Hey, Virus, you think this guy is a big dick? You're embarrassing me, and you're embarrassing yourself. Absolutely not. That was a fool. All right. I say we fuck, we don't need to fight these people. Let's just fucking head on. We know we have the information now. These people don't deserve to be killed by us. Well, they let us go though, is the more- They're gonna pay us flee. off. If all we have to do is just agree to their terms, they're gonna give us money. And then I say, I'll go make nice with this lady. I'll steal the fucking map. And then we'll go, we'll go get the shit. She's gonna, you're gonna make nice with her. She's gonna be expecting like a fucking rod. And then when she sees it, she's gonna go into a fucking rage. And then she's gonna try, they're gonna try she's, to kill us she all. She doesn't think I'm packing a fucking Magnum here. And when she sees what I'm working with, it's gonna be mayhem. She's gonna be thrilled. Just you shut the fuck up. I'm not convinced. All right, well, I, 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 I would think, what? I wanna see how this goes. I think this plan's really funny. All right, we're gonna we're gonna bank our whole plan on hyphens micro deck. Well, there's a plan B. There's what is that? A plan B. Fucking fight. But I'm we're saying gonna... we don't have to do that. <laughs> we, can we don't. We, we don't have to fight at all. We can. Yeah, we're, let's take the the payoff money first and foremost, right? Can okay. we all agree to that? Okay. Sure. Yeah. Let me ask her out. Let's see if she wants to take a walk at sunset. You know, out on the out on the grounds. You guys follow from a distance. Don't get seen. If I give the signal, bum rusher, but I don't think it'll be necessary because I feel like I'm going to work some magic here. I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a charismatic dude. I know how to play the violin. I'll play the violin to make to like set the scene a little bit. Yeah, you don't have a violin. You need her on looking you. at your free. I know how to play it. No. Hey, if you take her, if you take her on like a boat ride, I'll I'll poke my head out of the water and go like sha la 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 do be do. Like I'll do like something like that. It'll be romantic. Okay, that's actually a good idea. If you guys will serenade us while I take her on a boat ride. Yeah. I, I feel like we got this in the bag already. Yeah. Kiss, right. kiss the little dick okay. man. So you gotta go talk to her or what? So yeah, I fix my hair. I'm like, how do I look? I'm like, all right. It looks the same. All right. looks I the stroll same. over. You have a very short haircut. <laughs> Okay, fine, fine. <laughs> Stroll over. I say, a little smooch on your face, and I look my 
thumb and I kind of smear some schmutz. Okay, all right, right. thank you. Okay. I come up and I'd be like, oh, your dick's kind of small and I kind of try okay, to like fuck tug you. it to make fuck it off. Work. All right, I go. Wait, you tried to do what? Fluff it I try to tug it and make it sm- bigger. <laughs> All right, I push him away, and I and I, and I approach Vyrath. I say, Vyrath, mate, can can we talk? Sure. Okay. Uh, we decided we're gonna go with your agreement. We're gonna we're gonna take the uh, the payoff money that you you you're talking about, and we're gonna bow out graciously out of the cocaine business. We're gonna leave you to it. Okay. You can consider this mission accomplished. Cool. Hmm. Why would she not agree to the terms that she proposed? Oh, you're right. Okay, I don't need to roll for it. Sorry, you man. Roll. I just use whatever. All right. Uh, yeah, okay. She says okay. Okay. Now, I would just like to just offer as just just to, to celebrate our, our, you know, meeting of the minds and our, our mutual good fortune that seems to be smiling on both of us. You're getting what you want. We're getting what we want. Why don't, why don't we just uh, commemorate this, you and me, with a little hang sesh uh, this evening at sunset, I noticed there was this beautiful pond outside. Little being the key word. Maybe we could shut the fuck up. Maybe we could uh, take a little boat ride, have a toast, and, uh, you know, cheers to our good fortune. W- w- would you do me that honor? Hmm. You rolled a 19. Ooh. You know what? I, she uh... says you rolled a 19? Yeah, she says <laughs> that's her response. It's a strange thing to say, but I'm going to think that's a. Well, I mean, it's out of 20. I mean, you I'm think there's some say. fucking nerd out there who, like, when someone has hit on them, they've been like, you rolled a 20. <laughs> <laughs> I, I no, definitely yeah. think so. You know, yeah. there, think there's that a, man you know, was at 20. That was a, a fucking, crit success. There's been a, there's been and then a, three years later, when they're married, and they're getting in a fight, he's like, you rolled a one. You rolled a one. Shit. And you know there's like a d20 shaped wedding cake out there like you don't even have to google oh, it for I'll sure somebody's made it anyway so she goes you've rolled a 19 that means i'm moist as a snack cake yeah let's get out of here i don't uh, doubt it all right oh, <laughs> can we can God. we cut to sunset at the pond no 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 I, well, well, hold on we gotta talk about what are the other guys in a getting? movie what do you guys I want her aside and i ask her if there's a violin anywhere in the castle Okay. Well, it's not her castle. Maybe you can ask the dog or the guy. Oh, yeah. I asked the the wolf or the <laughs> guy who owns the wolf. You know what? You should ask the chef. The chef would know that, right? Yeah. I asked the chef, hey, do you know where there's a violin? Um, There might be some old stuff in the kitchen, but you could also just string up some like soup pans and some like spaghetti, maybe, you know, make, make, make an instrument. That's what you get when you talk to a chef about this sort of yeah. stuff. It's dumb as hell. I, I make a spaghetti violin. Oh my god! <laughs> wow. Just, I go I go get in the river. Dude, you got a fifteen, so you made a pretty decent spaghetti violin. <laughs> Peppermint, go, what are you gonna do musically? Uh, well, I'm not gonna do any music. I'm just I'm actually practicing my spider writing because the, I'm trying to do like walk off of ramps and do hops and stuff. Yeah, you, like that you don't want to contribute to the to the mission that we're all on right now. I'm trying to get my spider like up to top speed with like cool sure. tricks. It's right. like forget about a jack. It's Chinatown. It's like yeah. it's, it's peppermint. Just <laughs> yeah. don't 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 yeah. expect anything. Her 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 idea of like a musical accompaniment would be to throw a rock at this girl's head. Yeah. Right. Yeah. She's like maybe I it'll take help offense to that. Why? Because <laughs> I'm pretty awesome and I do some pretty <laughs> awesome things. All right. And True. you know, like I, I'm not stupid all the time. Okay. <laughs> Anybody have anything to say about that? I'm not stupid all the time. It's a great thing for anyone to say. It was like uh, very reminiscent of like John Candy's speech from Trains, Planes, and Right, yeah. No. I, I, like like me. Me. <laughs> I like me. My wife likes me. I'm not stupid all uh, the time. Pip asks up. Pip pipes up here and says, uh, "What is hyphen trying to make happen?" Sleep. <laughs> <laughs> that's four. That's four. That's four sleeps today. Yeah, uh, but it's nighttime, right? We're close to sleeping again. <laughs> it's getting there. Yeah, right. It's dusk. A very romantic time. 
All right, so uh, it's just become like a piece of clothing that you wear. <laughs> they have to occasionally punch in the face. <laughs> hey, hey, don't run away. <laughs> so we'll we'll cut to uh, a a little marsh, a little stream and marsh out right outside Cragmaw Castle. It's dusk. There's a lot of frogs and pelicans everywhere, <laughs> and uh, hyphen Potamu Seven and uh, not Sylvia Vireth. I can't believe they fucking named her that. Anyways, you guys are in a, a little canoe, and you're 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 going down the uh, down the down the stream and into the kind of marshy pond area. And there's like fireflies everywhere, and it's pretty nice. Wow, oh. yeah, I, I gotta say, you look you look pretty beautiful in this in this light. <laughs> that was a one. <laughs> she goes, okay, well, and you, you look all right too. Yeah, isn't that an like insult to be like in this light? Right. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I should I should also say you look beautiful in any light. I mean, you look stunning in in there. It's just now you look even more beautiful than than I could have imagined. So you know. You turn that shit around. That was a nineteen. So she goes, oh, thank you. And then she she fluffs her hair. <clears throat> the way she fluffs it, you can you swear that the uh, that the color of her hair almost like becomes even more white and it, her barrel, her hair almost billows out and it's almost like there's almost like changes for a second, like becomes even more beautiful. Wow. <laughs> okay. Um, I, I, you know, I just think it's so crazy how we're both, you know, wrapped up in this whole co cocaine business, you know, me no longer, but you still obviously are, are all wrapped up. And it's just like, we have a lot in common, you know? I, I, um, I think that's pretty cool. What, um, what's the deal with this like spider guy? Like what's his vibe? Let's see what we can work out of it. <laughs> you only got a two. So she says, well, you, uh, I just bought you out of the whole business. So why do you care? I'm like, this is good. I wish there was some kind of fucking romantic music playing okay. from somewhere. I, I, I stand up and I go like, sha la 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 la, size God. doesn't fucking matter. Fucking here, man. Size don't matter. Sometimes you need a good personality. Oh, wow, wow. <laughs> you I fucking really asshole. Just, I just rolled a one for his song. She goes, what is that? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Is there know. something wrong with the frogs around here? I go, you're Maybe. on your own, buddy. Okay, so now let's go to Bobo, right? Because he's he's tuning up. All right. Well, that violin got a seven, so yeah, it's all right. It's more annoying than anything. <laughs> this is, uh, you know, I, I'd say altogether, this is so far, what, like a six and a half on the romantic scale, maybe? Yeah. Not quite. I'm playing okay. November Rain, by the way. Do, 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 do. All right, let's cut the quick ultimate over. romantic song. We'll cut quick over to a forest grove where Peppermint is standing in a field with her spider. <laughs> well, I'm like, I'm on the bank of the, oh. the marshlands or whatever. Okay. Um, and I run, uh, I'm running on my spider and I do a big jump off of a rock. And then the spider shoots a web and like attaches onto a tree and like, like brings us up to the tree. And I'm like hanging upside down with the spider. I'm like, guys. Guys, did you see that trick? She got a 17, so it looks pretty good. So she's hanging upside yeah. down. <laughs> Does Vyrath see that? Yeah, let's see if Vyrath notices what she thinks. Okay. Got a 15. So Vi Vyrath sees, like, off of the distance, uh, the thing, like, whoa, uh, is that is that orc girl part of your group? No. No. <laughs> it's too bad. She is a stunning physical specimen. Okay. Okay. Uh. Where do you keep the map? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! You got I get let you get a nineteen for that line. So uh, she's like, "Well, I uh, ha have it in a pouch in my bedroom, but I was about to sell it to the the hobgoblin guy, and then and then you know head back to work, you know, working for the black spider." Yeah. You know, I've been trying to, uh, I dabble in, in cartography. I was wondering, do you think I could just, before you sell it, can I take a look at it? Because I am having a hell of a time getting some of my compasses right. And I would just appreciate any gander I could take at that bad boy. Could, could we make that happen? That's pretty good. Okay, so she says, uh, uh, well, 
I don't know if I want to, uh, I don't really know if I want to show it to you. It's, it's kind of a, you know, very important. Uh, kind hey, of I'm story. retired. You know, well, what, exactly. But uh, you're retired. So I'll tell you what, you meet me up in my bedroom in 10 minutes. Maybe I'll let you, let you have the map. This is where it's you all got a go deal. Out. I look over at foot and I'm like, this is where it's all going to go south, dude. <laughs> you were fine on the boat in the bedroom. We're fucked. <laughs> I start charging a magic missile. Why? Because <laughs> I know where this is going. <laughs> All right, Bobo, we haven't let you have any action for a second. What are you, you, you still just playing? I try, I try and play Flight of the Bumblebee. Okay, <laughs> this is not going to go well. The other most romantic song. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's just picking hard violin songs. All right, so you got an 11 on that. So, doo -doo 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 -doo, and then one of the strings breaks. <laughs> So hey, it was fine. I can play it, I swear. Okay, we'll, we'll do uh, one more move to Peppermint, then we'll get back to Hyphen here. Uh, Peppermint, what do you do? And you're hanging upside down on your spider. What's next? Yeah, the, and we come down from the web or whatever, and I'm just like, I've really got a handle on this spider, and I kind of walk up to the bank next to uh, Fut and, and um, uh, Bobo, and I yell out, how's it going? Shut the fuck up. Good. <laughs> it's good. Never mind. Oh. It's fine. Oh, man. They're going up to the bedroom. <laughs> cool trick. What? Cool trick. Going up to the bedroom? Yeah. Uh, okay, so uh, we better have plan B ready. <laughs> so is Virus into peppermint? Does Virus see peppermint? Does she react? So she's already walking up there, but uh, oh, she, she is. She's already walking into the yeah. So she left. She said, "Meet me in." So the am bedroom. I walking with her? Well, no. So you're still there. She said, "Meet me in the bedroom in ten minutes." So I'm sorry. Does it look hot she's when she's away. walking? Huh? Does it look hot when she's walking? Oh yeah. Cool. Her, I just rolled a nineteen for the way she walks away. So yeah, it looks. Does she have like that Jessica Rabbit yes. sort of swagger? She's got, yeah. she's got oh. a. It, and as she walks away, it's almost like her butt cheeks like form into an even better shape as they're walking. So wow. she starts walking into the uh, into the in, into the castle. So so and then that's when you guys are all having your moment down there. So okay, so uh, hyphen. Uh, so you think any you, fans that are so I, I say I say to fight. I'm like, guess what, dude? I flashed her a peek of my of my penis. She couldn't believe it. She invited me up to her bedroom. That's insane, dude. I was in the river the whole time and I saw that that didn't happen. So like, <laughs> I don't. It did happen. I didn't make it a big production. I just like, was like, I, I checked and I saw you weren't looking. And I was like, look what I'm working with. And then she was like, why don't you meet me in the bedroom in 10 minutes? At this <laughs> point, at this point. Why would I be hard, going up to her bedroom in 10 minutes? How hard I've been razzing it. How hard I've been razzing you. Even if you had an average sized dick, I would have seen it by now. <laughs> And then I say, hyphen, you, you showed virus your penis? <laughs> I mean, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, sure. Wow. All right. Yeah. Cool. Dude, I'm pulling for you. I really hope. <laughs> I really hope this works. But just so you know, when it doesn't, we're out here. I'm charging All missiles. Right. We're going to fucking come in and like, you know. Great. All right. If I love your new girlfriend. <laughs> I have a question i can oh uh, ahead, we're, we're not in the hall anymore it's just us can we see your penis now no just show it to us no what kind of you what's wrong with you guys no 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 we have there's pull yours out state. pull yours out all right fine i'll, I'll fucking pull mine out go ahead like, you guys, i pull my dick out oh yeah. weird gross ah uh, okay no i'm not pulling yeah. my dick out man okay pull your uh, fucking Wait, fuck, did you just pull your dick out? Is that what you're Yeah, I pulled my dick out. You, I rolled a 20 for that. So <laughs> his, his dick is huge. Oh my God. I'm like, oh I really my did, God. Oh I my only God. did roll a 20. So it's like, I mean, his dick is like a, it's like not, it's big, but it's not too big. It doesn't look weird. It's just like really good looking. And it's like perfectly smooth the way where it needs so to be smooth. We get whatever the dice roll is. Rough where it needs to be rough. <laughs> All right. Look, I'm going to pull mine out. Okay. I, I'm going to pull it out. Yeah, we look. We it is, all it have is a what vested it is. interest in how big your dick is now because our whole plan is fucking hanging on your dick. <laughs> well, it happens to be massive, so check this bitch out. All right, I'll pull it out. 
You got a 19. So. <laughs> Still bigger. Hmm. I happen to be a halfling, okay? Yeah. A 19 on me is like, this, I'm like right. the Babe Ruth of halflings. He's got, a, sorry. It, it, he's got a nice you know, girth to it. It's a nice girth. There's some good shading along the glands. There's even a little stamp, like a tattooed stamp right at the base that says really good for a halfling. What? <laughs> I, I turn to, to Peppermint and I go, this rules. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot, yeah. yeah. I mean, I, I'm sorry, like, you know, I, you know, they seem to be impressed, but I don't know when you're when you're walking around with a twenty between your legs, like <laughs> even a nineteen looks like fucking child's play. So, I don't get a lot of complaints. Uh, Let's just leave it at that. All right, I'm going up um, to the bedroom. Where are you going? Oh yeah, to hang out with your little boy. Enjoy yourself. Goodbye. Hey. So, oh, speaking um, of, oh shit, I gotta oh, see dude, if Pip get ready up. with that sleep nonsense. Uh, okay, so if, if Pip woke up again, he's a love. He got that. No, he didn't. Though, so. Put away my dick really quickly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's dicks about, boy. Go to back to sleep. I, 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 I put him to sleep again. Okay, let me make sure you can do it. Yeah, you got him. <laughs> yeah. So, and then my peppermint. Uh, she, she hasn't really been listening to this whole dick conversation or paying much attention to it, and she's a little confused, and she just thinks people are pulling their stuff out. So Peppermint pulls out her pussy lips. Oh. <laughs> Let's see how impressive that is. You got a two. Oh, God. Peppermint. <laughs> disgusting. Put they're that like, they're, Unreal. There's like tatters. That's bad. It's bad. <laughs> oh. Well, you got a two. I mean. I, I, go to, I, I go to Bobo. I'm like, can you believe he's hitting that shit? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Roll for Bob Bobo, did you whip out your piece yet or what? Yeah, but I put it back. But yeah, you can roll for me. Should we roll for it? Yeah. I'm now interested in how this works. You got a seven. Bobo, I would be whipping that thing out if I I think I think what seven means is it's just kind of like a a dick. It's know? just not it's impressive. Not when you're talking to a twenty and a nineteen and you walk in, I think it looks a fine. seven. It's fine. It looks fine. Yeah, Peppermint, yeah. who has uh, two pussy nice. lips. Uh, she has grade two pussy lips. She says your penis. Mine are fine. mutilated. It's like you two can roast yeah. beef. It's yeah. disgusting. Yeah, a two's gonna say a seven is fine, but like a twenty and a nineteen will tell you like it's not. <laughs> huh. All right. So I, I, your the invitation is out. I'd love to have a twenty and nineteen. That's amazing. <laughs> sure. Sure. Really beautiful guy. You think that hasn't been made abundantly clear? Peppermint, you and I are friends. It would be weird. I, I'm not. I mean, you know, I'm just saying. I'm just talking about the dick. You're drunk. No, not you. <laughs> You're drunk. All right, I'm gonna go up to the bedroom of that beautiful woman and uh, wag my 19 about, and let's see what happens. You guys hang here. Goodbye. All right. All right, Fucked, uh, or a hyphen walks back into the hallway, and uh, on the way up to the staircase, all the goblins and the chef are all lined up there, giving him the thumbs up, like kind of cheering. I'm him like off. 19 coming through. Look out, fellas! <laughs> <laughs> you see the wolf there. The, there's the wolf there too, and then you just walk up the stairs, and you 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 go into the bedroom, and it's it's dark in there, right? And uh, you hear Virus is Virus. Virus uh, her voice. Hey, uh, Virus, Virus, are you uh, <laughs> sulking about? <laughs> I'm on the bed and I'm ready. Uh, great, where's the mat? <laughs> well, I'm going to light this candle, but there's something about me you should know. Oh, well, uh -oh. yes. I'm not a dark elf. Huh? I am a shapeshifter. And the light comes on, and you see before you a naked, perfect replica of Peppermint Pissy, only with long, beautiful blonde hair. She says, come at me, boy. Oh, 